Driving up to the Cuner feedlot in northeast Colorado, visitors may notice a sign that says, No Public Tours. But that's more of an artifact than a rule at the 100,000 head yard. This year, they hosted more than 100 groups at Cuner, which is one of the 12 feedlots in the JBS Five Rivers group. I think um, we've realized that uh, uh, we don't have anything to hide, um, that we can show people what uh, progressive, you know, beef production looks like, and that if there is something they think we could do better, we tell them all, let us know, and you know, we want to do the best we can, and um, we want you to see our animals. They're healthy, happy. Our employees like to be there, and uh, we're proud of what we do, and, and uh, don't feel any shame in showing anybody that. Tours ramped up after Five Rivers completely renovated the lot in 2010. Since then, they've added a full-time tour guide, and Stone says they try to accommodate requests that include everyone from customers and industry partners to teacher groups and the World Wildlife Fund. It takes about 45 minutes to get to Cuner from the Denver airport, so that proximity is a big draw. And so it, it works pretty well for people to fly in for meetings in Denver with NCBA or USMEF and then come to the feed yard and, and see, a, see a feed lot. And also couple that with the Greeley, uh, JBS plant in Greeley just down the road 18 miles from us. Um, people can spend half a day and, and see a, a good packing plant and a good feed yard. Whether they come in a single SUV or by the bus full, Stone says his crew is happy to showcase their day-to-day -day operations and spread awareness about the cattle feeding business. We have a beautiful facility and, and uh, all the folks that work there care about the, the cattle and like their jobs and, and we're glad to show people that. I'm B.J. Scott.